the vibe. There's really not many things better than watching the man who sang that song hang out and sing that song. Thanks, and and do the, you know, trumpet part. Yeah. <laughs> Which is very, very cool. Hanging out with Jordan Knight, making his big appearance tomorrow at the Spotsylvania Town Center. Get out there early. Get your butts in line. Unless, of course, you got the VIP meet and greet. Mm. And then you don't got to worry about the line. That's right. right. That's so, what VIP is all about. That is what VIP is all about. And speaking of, we've got this set of VIP meet and greet passes that we're going to give away. But you wanted to give a trivia question out, right? Oh, yes, I did. All right. Go ahead. Ask the question. Well, somebody get a call in. Should we do it live or no? Is that what you want to do? Um, Listen, it's your show, honey. I'm just here. How 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 are, <laughs> are they get, just gonna call in? I was gonna answer? take caller number nine, call, and if they okay. got the right answer, All right, they get that. the VIP meet and greet. Okay, let's do okay? so give us your question. Who? Okay, That's we just heard "Give It to You." Yep. Right. And that was on my 1999 solo album. Who did I write that song with? All right, 735-1993. If you know the answer and you're calling number nine, you get to hang out tomorrow morning early with Jordan Knight at a VIP meet and greet, 735-1993. Give us a call right now. We'll have a winner for you right after this. <laughs> the vibe and we are having so much fun over here but we just realized that um this brand new microphone kind of sucks jordan like it's whack it is whack so jordan you're gonna just share your mic with me right that's right we're gonna get close here now so we're hanging out and uh you got some merchandise bringing tomorrow uh, did, did you bring any of those calendars haha <laughs> no no i'm still working on the calendar because because i'm using um uh, a few pitches from the fans. Well, two pitches from the fans. So I'm in the process of picking those two pitches, and then um, it'll be ready to go. But um, they both, I've already done pre-orders, and they'll be out very soon. Oh, of course you've done pre-orders. I saw the picture you, you posted to your uh, JordanKnight.com. Ah, yeah. Mm-hmm. If you didn't get a few million orders from that picture alone. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, I had to, you know, I had to throw that one in there. Not a lot of clothing budget on the calendar, exactly, huh? Exactly, yeah. I didn't have a large clothing budget, so I just, but I did the calendar anyhow. I said, what the hell? <laughs> what a trooper you are. You are. You- and I was really tired, and I, so I was lying in bed, and <laughs> and I was hot, too, so I took some of the covers off of, off of me. So, you know, I don't know. But I did it anyhow. Well, we appreciate you doing all that sacrificing for the fans. Exactly. You know anything for the fans. You know. You know how I roll. We do know how you roll. In fact, you are rolling into New York City this New Year's Eve, correct? This is true. Yes. Um, actually, tickets went on sale today. I don't know if they're gone yet, but if not, I think uh, go to nkotb.com. Um, get tickets. We're doing a a New Year's Eve show slash party. We'll have a DJ there, DJ Cheap Shot. We're gonna have Boys to Men there, singing their big hits, and then we're gonna do we're gonna do a concert and bring in the New Year with the, with all the fans. So, are you gonna bring the chapstick for midnight? What you and chapstick? <laughs> that's Howie from the Backstreet Boys. I <laughs> I don't have my own chapstick, although I do have you have some blue new sticks. iPhone oh, yeah. four cases, and they're really cool. We can FaceTime later. Your iPhone 4, my iPhone 4? Yes, we can. We can hang out? Okay, so cool. So, we had a couple of um, questions from the fans, by the way, on my Facebook page earlier this week or today, or I can't remember what day it was, but I asked them, you know, if you could ask Jordan Knight one question, what would it be? And the questions, I can't find right now. Oh, I know where it was. It was on my page, my Facebook page, because I have been posting for you a Jordan Knight video of the day yeah. all week long, right? So here's a question from Crystal. Crystal wants to know, are you going to give Virginia some love and bring your solo show here? Oh, we were just talking about that, weren't we? We were. We were talking about that. Um, I would love to. Where can I play? You guys tell me. I want to come and, and, and do, do a JKH solo show. I got a feeling that Crystal especially will say, my house. Well, <laughs> it's... Mm, depending how big your house is, can it hold uh, a couple thousand people? <laughs> and, of course, we've got Amy on here that says, same here. I want a solo show in Virginia. And then we have Lori who wants to know if you will marry her and uh, take care of her son, Jordan Jr. And, of course, that's my friend from high school. <laughs> right. Um, <laughs> very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't know what to say to that. Um, maybe, maybe not. Oh. 
it's not a no, Lori. There's a chance. Lori Northrup. <laughs> will Jordan take, if I marry you, will little Jordan Jr. take care of us when we're old and decrepit? That's the question. <laughs> you get back to me on that, and I may have an answer for you. I heard he's going to be a lawyer. Maybe That's uh, right. He's in college. Hmm. So no child support. Well, no well yeah. Will he pay his own college tuition? That's another good question. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lori, now you know, my dear. Now you know. Okay, so I have shown you my embarrassing picture from when I was 14. Now, what I want to know from Jordan Knight is, what is the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you? Um, oh, uh, um. Come on, I mean, we see YouTube videos of people falling off a stage. Oh, oh, what happened? Uh, there's a recent, there's a recent embarrassing thing, um. I was doing a, uh, I was doing a, an interview not too long ago, about a week ago. I was in Canada and, um, it was in the green room of a TV station and there was a glass behind me, a plate of glass, you know, looking outside, whatever. And in the reflection, you could see my butt crack. The whole <laughs> entire interview. Like I thought I was being like cool and charming and there I am with my butt crack showing the whole interview. So. It was funny because a lot of the uh, fans were like, hey, Jordan, uh, what's cracking? And I was like, why are they asking me this? And they kept referring to crack, 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 whatever. You must have been on crack in that interview, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, why do they keep saying that? And then uh, I saw a, a link to a, one of the videos and I said, there, there it was. My crack was showing the whole time. Anyhow, moving on. So where exactly can we find that on YouTube? Just write Jordan Knight crack interview. <laughs> All right, and speaking of Jordan Knight things, um, what's with Tink? Oh, well, Tink, um, Tink is is the sound that um that my eyes make when I when they open in the morning. When they go, my, oh, I heard it. My, I see, you heard it. I heard it. See, I I thought it was all only in my mind, but it actually does make a noise. It does. It made a noise. I just said, do it again. Hold on. Yep, there it was. Oh, I heard it. That was amazing. It, it does make a noise. <laughs> And you know what else makes a lot of noise? Your fans. And they are going to be lined up around the block tomorrow morning at the Spotsylvania Town Center in the food court near JCPenney. We are going to be hanging out there. I am starting there broadcasting live at 9. Jordan is going to show up after his VIP meet and greet at 11. He'll be there till 1.30 signing autographs. And um, I just got word also that we've got some CDs to give away. Is that right? Tell us about your brand new CD. Oh, we do? We oh, do. Oh, that's good. <laughs> I'm giving away CDs. Yeah, my CD, Unfinished, has been out since May 31st, yes, I believe. Um, I'm giving it away uh, tomorrow. Do some select... No, no, no. We're giving it away. You We're giving it away now. Them. You're oh. selling them tomorrow. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for clearing that up. Um... We're giving them away, yes. You tell us about that. I don't know anything about it. <laughs> Who wants one? How about caller number nine right now, 735-1993. In fact, how about caller number eight? How about, well, how many, let's, let's, how let's about, do, let's you, give you do a, it. Let's give everybody a taste of what's on the CD first. Okay. And then we'll give it away. Okay. This next, can I, yeah, yeah, please. can we go? Please. This next song is featuring a bandmate and very good friend of mine, Mr. Donnie Wahlberg. The song is called Stingy. Yeah, a little paying a little homage to PM Dawn in this one, too. I absolutely love this cut off of Unfinished. Here's Jordan Knight on 99.3 The Vibe. 99.3 The Vibe. Well, I have just been enjoying such a wonderful afternoon with Jordan Knight and his crack. Uh, <laughs> we were just watching the video. It's fantastic. You got to look up Jordan Knight's crack on YouTube. It's worth it. Yeah, we think the cameraman knew the whole time that my crack was showing, actually, because he's like panning out, making sure everybody gets a good view. <laughs> and we thank him for that. We do thank him for that. So, all right, we got these CDs to give away. Should we do this? Yes. How do you want to do it? I don't know. How do you give CDs away? <laughs> Just read that number over there. Oh, Vibe Studio line is 735-1993. Call in and win your Jordan Knight unfinished CD Woo! now. Woo! 735-1993. We'll take, what are we going to do? We're going to give away. I'm sorry, posing for a picture. <laughs> We're going to give away like three CDs. Should we do that? Yes. Will you kiss them all? Yes. <laughs> Yes, I will, she with kinda, my chapstick. With his chapstick-covered lips, and he'll sign them for you? Will you sign them for us? I will. Yes. Look at that. I love it. When it's my show, 
people do what I want. That's so great. Seven three five one ninety nine three. Let's take caller seven seven or seven eight and nine. Oh, that's a terrible picture. Can we read through that, please? <laughs> it is ninety nine three. The vibe. Call now if you want to win that CD. The morning vibe with Tony B. Do me a favor, go turn that light out. No, it's Crystal Blue hanging out with Jordan Knight. And honest to God, sometimes I can't even believe I'm here. Oh. We had so much fun. Got a couple of CD winners. Christina, Teresa, Melanie, we can't wait to see you tomorrow. Jordan's going to kiss those CDs for you. You betcha. Going to give him a, one big smooch. Um, but anyhow... I think my time is up here, folks. Um, I'll see everybody tomorrow. Crystal, see you tomorrow. Thank you very yeah. much. Um, people, doesn't not, doesn't she have such a, a, a sweet voice? <laughs> and she's sweeter in person. Oh, and all, after all of that, he's finally following me after two years on Twitter. I'm so excited. That's right. <laughs> I, fo- I follow a lot of people. I actually have to follow some more people because I try to follow more than 1% of my followers. So I have to follow a bunch of people tonight. Which number over 150,000. I just want to put that out there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, you see, we were just talking off the air. Like, Twitter has brought you so close to your fans. Right. No, you, no the question you, you were asking, like, what did you do before Twitter? Like, Yeah, it, 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 do you remember in the 90s? Because you never replied to my fan letter. It was No, it was <laughs> just a couple of years ago. I, yeah, a couple of years ago, I joined Twitter and uh, was not sure about it and now it's like the best thing ever. It's it's great for a group like us, you know, to to, to keep close to the fans and, and the fans to keep close to us. So it's the best best invention on earth. It is the best. Almost as good as meeting you in person, which everybody can come out and do tomorrow morning at the Spotsylvania Town Center. 11 o'clock is the autograph signing. It goes till 1.30. Get there early. Get yourself in line. Stand in line at your own discretion, though, because we are going to do our very best to get everybody through the line before Jordan has to leave. Where are you off to next? Me, right now? Yeah. Or after? No, no, after the, tomorrow. Well, I go home, and then um, I'm, 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 I'm off. <laughs> I'm, I'm taking a break for Christmas, and then hopefully I'm coming back here to do a show. We yeah. Gotta, we got to talk about that. We do got to talk about that. We'll, we'll put it on the calendar. All right, everybody. Jordan Knight hanging out with me. Thank you so much for hanging out with me so long. I know you're hungry and you need a nap. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to let the poor man like rest. Old man. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We will see him tomorrow morning. You guys have been great fun. And, uh, yeah, that's it for Jordan Knight. He's going to be hanging out. I'm sure he'll be tweeting lots tonight. So he won't forget to tink, I'm sure, right? No, no, no forgetting to tink. That's right. All right.